Well, the police chief tells me that last night one of his officers stopped a man and a woman to check on them here near the pharmacy in town. And the chief says that's when the man took off and started running through this field. He says he started shooting at police. Now, the officer is okay, but as of right now, they're still looking for the shooter. Given his past history out of Texas, it's all violent felonies. Tonight, police are searching for Renee Bullduck. The police chief says the 45-year-old man has arrest warrants out of Texas for escape, parole violations, and aggravated assault. Police are not sure why Bullduck is in Waldron, but they are questioning the woman he was with. This surveillance picture shows Bullduck without any shoes, just before police spotted him this morning after breaking into an apartment complex. Whose clothing description matched that of our suspect. When officers went to the area, they spotted a, an individual matching that description. And as soon as he saw officers, he took off running. Police just went through down at the apartments. Waldron residents were already taking precautions for coronavirus. Now they're on the lookout for the man police say is armed, dangerous, and desperate. We have put bookcases in front of the children's windows. Um, we've made sure all the windows are locked. Um, we've actually brought our dog in the house and we're prepared any way we can be. They could be on drugs. They could be, um, when, they're, when they're out there like that, they just have no morals and they don't care who they hurt. And um, I'll do anything to protect my family and my children the best we can. We have prepared better than most people have. And tonight, police, deputies, and law enforcement from across the area, they'll keep canvassing the neighborhoods until they find that man. And the police chief says, as of right now, the woman who's with has not been charged in connection to the shooting. Live in Waldron, Brett Rains, 4029 News.